What's up, man? Not that much. Episode 45. I feel like we're starting to get on a roll again. Correct. Yes. Feels good. It does so, feel uh, this is awesome. We are now in October. Officially. Today. Yeah. I'm very excited about that. So um, I was approached by a gentleman about sponsoring episode 45. Um, yes. I'm not sure how I feel about this one, but I, I told him I'd, I'd share it. And, uh, you know, we'll just go from there. Um, he sent me an ad picture, um, which isn't very uh, appealing. But, you know, I, I told him, I was like, dude, I'll give it a shot. We'll see how many of these things we can sell. All right, you ready? Yes. All right. From the creators of the inflatable dartboard and the waterproof sponge comes the most terrifyingly useless product you've ever seen. Introducing... The Haunted Banana Peeler. Tired of peeling your bananas the normal way? Looking to add some danger and mystery to your life? Well, now you can. With the Haunted Banana Peeler, every peel is a suspense-filled journey into the unknown. You shouldn't have bought this. I just wanted to peel my banana, said one user, but now my lights keep flickering and I hear whispers in my closet. That's right, it's completely useless and 100% dangerous. No matter how many times you use it, it never works. But it will summon unwanted spirits and possibly ruin your life. Another customer stated, I haven't slept in days, but my bananas are still unpeeled. It's perfect for a night when you don't feel like doing anything productive. One demon said, peel the banana or else. Order now, we'll throw in a free equally haunted banana. Just nineteen ninety nine, but act fast because supplies are endless, and so is the torment. <laughs> Call Wayne eight hundred Banana Doom and prepare for eternal peeling frustration and fear. But it comes with a warning here: haunted banana peeler may cause sleepless nights, existential dread, and strange banana-related nightmares. Not recommended for children, the faint of heart, or anyone who enjoys a calm, peel-free life. Get yours today. The haunted banana peeler. Man, I don't know what the demographic is for that, but we'll, we'll see what happens one. here. Yeah, yeah. I'm assuming everyone. Yeah, I ordered one, so we'll see how it goes. Yeah, dude, that scared me. <laughs> <laughs> God damn. Yeah. So, so you brought up this this subject. You know, we want October. We want all like horror haunted related uh topics you brought up a pretty good one like would you survive yeah going against so and so and i was like well that's yes. interesting i'd like and yeah. uh we listed off a bunch here i think i came up with 22 yeah and, something uh, like that i mean there's there's a huge list huh yeah list, huh? yeah a little bit but yeah we'll just go back and forth and then we'll talk about some hidden gem uh horror movies that do for some reason doesn't get the recognition they deserve. And then we'll close it out on that. Sounds good. All right. Do you mind if I go with the first character that you think you could survive or not? Go ahead. All right, Sound ready? It out. All right. Go. Uh, P. Diddy. Oh, shit. Is there lube involved? <laughs> Buckets of it. Good. I think I'm all right. I'm going to be in a slippery situation, but yeah. I think I'm all right. Yeah. <laughs> That's all right. I had to throw that in there. Yeah. <laughs> that shit is fucking ridiculous. <laughs> no. You got arrested no. wearing a trench coat. Yeah. Right, slippery, in a, man. right in a hotel lobby. I was like, damn. <laughs> it's raining. All right. All right, back on those. So the first character, Brandon. Here we go. On if you could survive. Jason Voorhees. Hell no. Nah. No. no so this way I looked at this. Um, I want to say absolutely not, but I have to split. I have to do like a split think on this one. Is it prior to part six? Right. If it's that's prior the thing. to part six. I think I might have a small chance. Yeah. But if it's after part six, nah, dude. That supernatural shit. Pfft, nope. That ain't happening. Yeah. I know, I started oh. thinking, I was like, you know what, maybe I'll think about the remake one, when he was just, like, fucking wild. Uh, yeah, part 
I would say part two on um, is some serious shit. It's not going to be yeah. a good day. I don't appreciate the setting. Um, I'm not good with, with the woods. He'd want well, that's another me. thing. Yeah, is it? Is it? Where's he at? My house. What? Yeah. Either way, do he gets in? Like, what are you gonna do? Well, I know my house. He don't. So. No. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Does it matter? Probably not. Yeah, I'm gonna say no. No, I'm gonna say no on that one too. He's yeah. just a big, massive dude, man. He runs. He's not. You know, he's gonna chase you down. It's. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna be in a good situation encountering him so no probably not yeah number two freddy krueger no no man you don't think no, so man. shit no man <laughs> <laughs> dude plain and simple dude no uh did you end up walk, like sleepwalking into uh straight into his dream realm where he's just having a fucking cup of coffee just waiting for you and just unload on some killer ass fucking lines dude <laughs> you know I I think my imagination is so messed up. He'd be like, oh, what the fuck? I think I'd beat yeah. him. <laughs> you think I'd beat him? <laughs> I think I'd beat him. Dude. Oh, my God damn it, bitch. <laughs> yeah. Dude, my <laughs> dreams are so fucked up. Yeah. They're really messed up and they're really yeah. vivid. I think yeah. I'd one-up them. Like, I really think he'd be like, oh, shit. Like, <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude. So, yeah, I he, think... Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know, man. The way I'm, I, I thought about it is like, I'd be, I'd wind up in the fucking uh, a dream to where it's like, the ground was just broken glass, and he's chasing me, and I have oversized shoes on, and <laughs> with with spaghetti laces. Yeah. You know? So that's that's the shit I was thinking. I was like, dude, there's no fucking way he's chasing me. Yeah. Dude, there's no fucking way I'm done, dude. There's no yeah. way with him. <laughs> you can't go to sleep. What are you gonna do? Yeah. Not sleep. That's. Just- You've seen how that happens in the movies. Yeah, that's not good. Oh, that's yeah, the worst. So. Speaking of which, like, I watched this thing. Uh, it was that Mr. Ballin. Did I tell you about that? That insomnia that kills you? Oh, yeah. You're the one who's telling me. Oh. Dude, I was just thinking about it. I was like, who the hell told me about that? Oh, dude. I couldn't. I could not imagine that. Like, no matter what these people do, they could not fall asleep. No matter how tired they get, they would shoot up and, like, just... Be become wide awake again and just keep doing that until they literally die. Shit. Yeah, I was like, "Fuck that." No, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, Michael Myers. I feel like I should be able to survive. He walks. You know. Um, you should be able to get away from him, right? You, you would mean, think so. I mean, um, just don't run upstairs into a closet. Yeah, or in the basement, and I f I feel like you're all right. <laughs> I I feel like it's so weird. Michael is uh, he's very inconsistently written to where like mm -hmm. he's able to sneak up on anyone. He's able to overpower anyone until the last fifteen minutes of the movie, and then for whatever reason, like dude, I, and I want to do an episode revisiting David David Gordon Green's trilogy. Mm -hmm. I don't understand how you can take on an entire mob or overpower all these people and then get in a fist fight with a 70-year-old Lori Strode in a kitchen and lose. Like, it just doesn't – it doesn't make crazy, sense to me. It's a crazy yeah. time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <You know? laughs> so it's just like he just loses ability, like, at the like last 15 minutes of the movie. Um. Yeah, you just have to keep your head on a swivel. Yeah, I feel, but, I feel like that one I'm going to go with yes. I'll say yes. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, that's a rough yes, too, because come on, man. I know he's got it. I know yeah. he can get me. You know? He's got that dog in him. They just yeah. they need to stop. They need to make a good movie that just makes sense and stop relying on people loving the character. Yeah, yeah. You know? Leatherface. Oh, dude. This one's going to be a hard one. I'm going to yeah. say no fucking um, way. Yeah. I mean, he runs. I feel like um, if you escape, he's going to chase you down, dude. I mean, <laughs> plus all I, the family members and whatnot. Like, yeah. How do you know community? who are you going to trust? Yeah. That, that's, a, that's a no. Yeah. There's no way you're surviving I, that. I honestly think once that chainsaw like rips up 
I die I'm standing gone. in a puddle of my piss. I'm gone. Like I'm, I'll just be like, uh. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the only thing I can hope for is he didn't choke it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> God. Like, all right, I got ten steps. I got ten <laughs> steps. Choke that shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Never worked like that, huh? He's always that one pull dude. Just a strong dude, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. Did you ever see the new Netflix Texas Chainsaw Massacre? I have not, actually. It was... It wasn't as bad as a lot of people said it was. It's definitely not perfect. But, man, he had some fucking wicked moments in in that movie. I might have to to bring it up soon. It was a good... It's a good watch. It's entertaining. Okay. It's entertaining. Um... It really pisses on. I think they went out of their way to shit on David Gordon Green's uh, no Halloween trilogy. Yeah, you'll you'll if you watch it, you'll know. I'm okay. I'm gonna I want to bring it up in the next episode when if we ever revisit that. So yeah, I'm gonna go Leatherface. There's no way for me. Um, yeah, Hannibal Lecter. Yes. Yeah, I mean, I yeah. think so too. I, I mean, I'm sure you know he's. Like, remember in the movie, um, Jack Crawford said, you know, his only weakness is his ego. I yeah. feel like if you compliment him, I think he'd be like, okay. Uh, Maybe. Yeah. Like, wow, this 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 steak is divine. Sir. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know? yeah. Well, thank you. Thank yeah. You. <laughs> I would yes. be like, he is too fucking creepy as a normal person for me. I'd be like, mm. eh, I'm not even going to come near this guy. I feel like if I don't go near this yeah. guy, I'm probably pretty yeah. okay. If he's standing there, like when Clarice came around the corner, he's just standing in the cell. If he's just standing there, I'm like, nah, screw this. You yeah. Know, I'm, yeah. I'm heading out this way. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not about that right Nope. Now. Yeah. No shit. <laughs> All right, Brandon. The Xenomorph. For those who don't know, that's the alien from Alien. This is This is no way. There's no fucking way. No way. There's no, no way. <laughs> There's, you know, you know, guns don't work. You know, normal guns don't work on that. That at all. Um, I, do they use echolocation? I don't know. I mean, I figure with a dome head like that, most animals that have dome heads, they have like echolocation. I don't. Know, maybe, maybe not. That's what I'm just thinking of a dolphin, maybe. But yeah. Um, yeah. There's. It, I'm sure they can smell you. They, yeah, you're you're not escaping. Yeah, it's able to hide. It, it knows how to hide. Yeah. Um, and fast. then I feel like if you uh, it, like what they kind of pissed on on the um, aliens. If you ever think of aliens, like mm-hmm. you know their blood is acid, yeah. and you have these space marines just spraying fucking blood everywhere. Yes. I'm like, wouldn't everything just start melting all over yeah, the place? Yeah. It just keep melting through, right? Yeah. Yeah, you're 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 screwed. Yeah, yeah. There's no fucking way. There's no, no way. No, nah. hell no. Nah. Yeah, and then uh, we go to this guy, Predator. Uh, no. Yeah. No, it's like <laughs> no on an everyday level. Hell no. Nah, yeah, going one on one. I mean, the only thing you, he can be defeated um, with guns. You know, he, he was shot in the movie, so you know he bled. So I mean. You, but I mean, he's got thermal vision. You're screwed there. I guess if you can disguise your body temperature like Arnold did, yeah, maybe you might be able to prolong it. But I mean, he also got your shoulder cannon. So yeah, that would be that would be my luck. I'd go out like Duke did. You know, he's like crawling through, and he looks up. He's like, oh shit! Yeah, just (laughs) smash my head like a watermelon. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah, that, yeah that, that's a no for me. Yeah, I'm not the big hulking dude to take this fuck around one on one. So Hell I would, no. yeah, I'd just be sitting there like fucking embarrassed, like three in the morning, my fat ass rolling downstairs to get like a cheese stick, and then you just hear the like, huh? Just get my ass blown away. Damn. Yeah, this guy's this guy's like predator would be like, I'm not wasting, I'm not wasting my time on this guy. Yeah. Yeah. The fuck. Yeah. Okay. Get some hey, of my whatever, kids man. fruit snacks. Yeah, I tell you what, I eat cheese. I eat randomly. I shouldn't say randomly. There's a good amount of days I eat uh, cheese sticks for breakfast, just because it's easy to just. It's quick. Shove in my mouth. Yeah. But, unless no, it's after. Right. Unless it's after banging, then it's my kids fruit snacks for some reason. Oh, gotta restore yeah. energy levels. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Replenishment. Yeah. Good. Dora's here. No. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> swipe, no, no swipe. Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah. Uh, the ring girl. Man, dude. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna say I'll be able to survive it because I'm just not gonna watch the fucking movie. How about that? Yeah, yeah. What am I gonna do? Order the fucking video on on Prime. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, what's this? It says I cursed won't, I videos. Just won't tape. Watch it. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, I'm good. I won't watch it. I, I survived. Yeah, yeah. And then if I do watch it, it calls my phone yeah. like, ah, oh, it's fucking spam. What is she gonna do? Yeah. Email me. Yeah. Seven good. Days. Okay. See ya. Yeah. 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 I mean. I guess if you had to survive it, there's no, you're not going to survive that. I mean, no. she's freaking, uh, was she a spirit? I think, yeah, she's a yeah. spirit. So, I mean, you're kind of like, you're done. There's yeah. nothing you can do. You can't set, you can't use weapons. You can't set traps or, you know, it's just you're done. no religious artifacts, no holy water. So you're, you're done, dude. Yep. Peace. Um, Jaws. Just don't go in the water. Dude, no, I wouldn't. Like, <laughs> Obviously, to even face him, you'd have to be in the water. Yeah, water straight up in the water. No, you're done. Scares me. Scares. You're done. I love the water. I love the ocean. And there was one day we went snorkeling, and in in uh, the Bahamas, and that water, you know, that water's clear yeah. as ever. Man, I just keep looking off into the distance, like, okay, I could probably see because you know it's there, forty or fifty feet, and then like, did I see something? Did I see? Is that? You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I always picture just something. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh. To this yeah. day, I don't I don't know if I ever told you this story, but in 2001, I was in Captiva Island, and, dude, we were stupid. Me and Lance, we were really stupid. This water was waves like crazy. We were excellent swimmers. We were really good. And it was stormy. The waves were big. Like, my brother didn't go in. My parents didn't go in. Him and I went out about a good 30 feet, and we were swimming. And he was ahead of me, and I know he was ahead of me. And I'm swimming, and I kick something. Dude, I mean, I can't touch. We're probably, there's probably 15 feet down worth of water. I kick something fucking hard. Like, boom. I was like, God damn, like, ow. And he goes, and he stopped. He's like, what? I was like, I just fucking kicked something. And I had to ask. I was like, did I kick you? And I know I didn't because he was ahead of me. And we both just. Because you're shitting right now. We just screamed shark, shark, yeah. and took off yeah. to the shore. Yeah. And we didn't go back in. I was like, man, we should not have fucking been out there. Like, it was the, probably a fucking tuna, too. You know? <laughs> yeah, probably. It, dude, <laughs> it was something to the point like, boom. So, like, I was like, ow. So we um, we were on base, and um, there's a beach on base. We we're drinking. Nighttime, for some reason, there's a little. Um, uh, sandbar quite a quite a ways out I'm uh-huh. saying like 50 60 yards and our stupid ass was we swim to the sandbar you did not you know? yeah we got to the sandbar fucking hung up uh, you know we swam swimming back me and my buddy swimming sw- side by side both of us felt something oh and i no. i swear to god dude we we we're the fastest swimmers on earth yeah that night we were already on land like it was wow. that fast and I was like, did I kick you? And he's like, no, I thought I'd do the same thing. I was like, dude, we're a good distance apart. There's no way we kicked each other. Wow. I like, threw up, like, thinking about it. Like, so like, yeah. Dude, that's oh, how my I God. was. Like, we'll never do it again. And that's I how never, I was. Ever was in the water again at nighttime. Yeah. Yeah, so Screw Jaws. That. that was stupid. Yeah. Stupid. Yeah, when you said that, I was like, ooh, Brandon. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That was dumb. Really dumb, dude. Yeah. I'll never forget that. All right, zombies. Now, we got two okay. classes right here, all right? We have zombies from the Night of the Living Dead, which, you know, okay. kind of walk in. And um, and then we have World War Z slash, you know, 28 days, weeks later zombies. Oh. How do you feel? Dead. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, Night of the Living Dead, this is the original, like, yeah. 68 movie or whatever. Oh. 68 and then the 90 version. <laughs> nah, we, I'll be all right there. There's yeah. No really, really, I mean, they, they're walking. Yeah, I feel if you find some, uh, find a good weapon, you know, decent shelter, somewhere, like, 
in the water, like you know, on like an island would be ideal. Mm-hmm. Okay, you'd okay. Right. Yeah, you'll be all right. Yeah. World War Z. World War Z. Twenty eight weeks Dude, those later, motherfuckers climbed. Dawn of the Dead. Yeah, they climb like each ants. other. They're they're, like they're the... fucking like super fast. Yeah. Dude, there's no way. Yeah, fuck. You know, the, the only way outrun outrun other people. Yeah. Because I'm gonna assume you're in a city right now, right? Sure. That's that's what I'm picturing in World War Z. Yeah, and you just outrun other people, throw people down. Fuck, I don't. You know, yeah, like, right. What do you do? You know, they're gonna attack whoever's there. I think. Yeah, I mean, then you know, if you're okay, if Brad Pitt shows up, just get the fuck out of there. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, dude, why does everywhere later? you go, everything gets ruined? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the twenty uh, weeks later, zombies. Yeah, no. Done. <laughs> no, dude. It was, those dudes are even. More crazier, dude. dude. And that's another subject I want to talk about: an opening scene to actually, a movie. Oh, dude, we should do so. I actually was thinking about. Um, I had a list of things I've been randomly thinking about, and it was uh, best opening scenes. Yeah, for movies. We could definitely go yeah. on that for yeah, sure. It don't have to be horror, but I mean, I I, I thought about that not too long ago. Horror, uh, though. Speaking of Whew, that sets it up. Twenty eight weeks later. Did you know there's twenty eight years later coming? Yeah, out next yeah, year? it's gonna be awesome. Yeah, yeah. I'm excited for that. All right, uh, this one is interesting. I'm going to let you pick whichever one. Ghostface. Which, whichever one, what do you mean? From Scream, Ghostface. From, yeah. They're all different. Oh, okay. I'm going okay. to go Billy and Stu from the first one. Okay, okay. I feel like this should be a go. Like, I should be able to do that. Um... Are we in the movie like situation? Sure, let's like go my, in the movie. House? Yeah, okay. um, in the movie, yeah. Don't you, obviously you're not going to trust anybody. Do you know? Do you know who's the killers? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I wouldn't trust anybody. I'd stay far away from Sidney Prescott. Everybody's a um, suspect. <laughs> yeah, my favorite fucking character in the world. Yeah. Uh, Son of mask. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just don't go around Sydney, and I think you'd be alright, right? Yeah. I feel like they're very, for some reason, I don't know what it is with Ghostface, like, very clumsy. Mm-hmm. It's yeah, very clumsy, that, yeah. like, flying all over the place, like, ah! and that's almost every single movie, um, until, it, you know, until he's, like, searching for you, and he's just smooth, you know, calculated, and that really relies on the element of surprise. If it's, mm-hmm. if I get the first look, I feel pretty good about myself. Probably yeah. like Michael Myers too. If I get the first look, if I if, whoa, what's that? I'm gone. Uh-huh. If if they catch me by surprise, I'm I'm boned. Yeah, well, that's that's also he's human too. So I mean, if you had a gun, I mean, you win. Yeah. So, didn't think about that, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of guns, uh, for this next one, Art the Clown. Oh shit, man. Um, wow. So is he? He's supernatural, right? Yeah, yeah, sort of. Yes. I mean, I mean he got he got blown in the head. Then he he came back to life. Yeah, uh, he came back to life for the second so, one. So yeah, I he's supernatural. He Man, dude. He they've even come to say that. Did you ever see the second one? Yeah. The bedroom scene. Mm-hmm. Like, there's no way that girl is alive. So technically, no. they're saying that he actually has a power. That he could keep you alive as long as he wants before letting you yeah. go. Oh, shit. Yeah. Dude, that's fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> so I guess in a situation with him, be, be nice to him when he approaches you. I don't think it matters. <laughs> hey, man. You could try. You're really cool today. <laughs> you could try. You could try. Make him happy. I don't know. <laughs> Dude, he's the one that really he really shattered a lot of rules. You know, mm-hmm. when uh, you think that that chick had to, you know, in Terrifier, spoiler warning, in Terrifier when she had to one up on him, and all of a sudden he's just like nine millimeter. Yeah. No, I, I, like, didn't, I didn't expect him to use a gun. Duh. Yeah. Fuck was that was the that? only kill, wasn't it? That one with the gun. Yeah, yeah uh, until the, the one. second one where the mom's car got shaving cream, and she's oh, like, "Oh my god!" Right. 
and you know she wipes it off and he's sitting there like hey here's a here's a fucking shotgun boom <laughs> yeah yeah i didn't think about that uh, I'll, th- I'll say I'll, I'll say i'll say no i'd say no i think i'd want to die after the yeah, shit i've seen with him yeah like no i just be cut, cutting you up yeah hanging upside down just fucking hacking away yeah yeah <laughs> just uh, do that, yeah. That one, that scene, and everyone knows what we're talking about. Hanging, like if I, Brandon, if I had to watch you go upside down, and that done to you, I would just be like, "Did you watch? You did you see? What you am see I see me piss on my face? Yeah, first off. yeah. Like, so. <laughs> what am I fighting for right now? Like, yeah. just end me. The rest of my life's <laughs> fucked. Like, yeah. I just shit all over the place too. Yeah, yeah. Uh, just be like, eh, okay, damn it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh, uh, God. All right. Um, v- the Vampires from Dust Till Dawn. So why'd you pick Dust Till Dawn? I don't know. I just thought it was very interesting. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. You did, You couldn't, like, pick Twilight? Oh, I know it went against that. That's yeah. so- <laughs> <laughs> huh. Um Is Selma Hayek going to be there? Oh, I guess I would lose. Yeah. yeah <laughs> I'd be way too distracted. Yeah. Shit. Um there's vampires. Yeah. Whoa. My my dad <laughs> and a buddy of his, I don't know if I ever told you this. My bad my dad and a buddy of his from when that movie come out, they made a pact to each other like, "Hey, if that scene's on television, we'll call each other." Oh, no way. <laughs> and I didn't know they did that until like it was like 10 years ago. Phone rang. It was like Office Space. Hey, Peter, turn on Channel 9. Yeah, do a Change the channel. And there, yeah. And there's a change the channel, and there was fucking, there's Selma Hayek, and hung up, and he's like, yeah, me and Kent, we have an agreement. You know, we call each other. And I was like, get the fuck out of here. I was like. That's awesome. I was like, that's true friendship right there. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah. I thought that was great. Made it 50 years ago. <laughs> yeah. No shit. <laughs> that's funny. Yeah. Yeah, um, well, you just you just get some sunlight, you know. I think you'd be all right. I just, I want the gun. I want the cock gun. Oh, yeah, yeah. Come on, sex machine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If we're, if, no, if you, if you're, is there other people around? Like sure. You and there's, okay, yeah. You and I are at the bar. Like, yeah. Oh, fuck, here we go, yeah. Brandon. At that bar? Yeah. Yeah, oh, fuck, no, we're done. We're done? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> If we had a good group of people, we might be able to take them on, I feel. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe, maybe. It'd probably be like me, you, Eric, and Tim. Yep. I think I feel... Yeah, fucked. Yeah. Fucked. <laughs> <laughs> no. That'd be a tough one, but yeah, probably not. No, huh? Nah, I don't think so. Yeah. You I think, think so? No, I think we're fucked. Oh, okay. Yeah. I was like, damn, dude, I want to hear your reason. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, like I said, I'd be too distracted. Yeah. I'd probably go way. how Tarantino went, you know, like, yeah. just like, oh, man, this chick's hot. Knife through my hand, I'm fucked. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch. Nice. That'd be it. Chucky. Oh, dude, come on. This this has got to be easy. Yeah, after the I mean, first if, one, if, if I feel if you overpower them, you, you win. Yeah, after the first one, where it's like the element of surprise, all the other ones, like yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna kick this fucker like a football. Yeah, like, yeah I'm gonna whoop your ass. Yeah, <laughs> like I have no idea how anyone is just like completely oblivious that a doll is like running around. Yeah. Son of a bitch! Yeah, you motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> Goddamn woman drivers! <laughs> <laughs> That's another yeah, one. That, that, I love the character. Movies aren't that great. No, no. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine with the character. Yeah, it's, and I'll watch it if it's like, eh, whatever, you know. But no, no I'm good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Pennywise. No. Yeah, no, I'm done. Yeah. No, that's it. I'm done. There's I, no I, reason to explain. I don't, I don't know if I would die by the hands of him. I think I would take my own before. Yeah. Uh, knowing he's coming for you yeah yeah i was like you know what i don't i'm not experiencing that <laughs> not knowing that i just have to bully yeah. him 
That was so <laughs> fucking weak. That was so weak. You're yeah. a poopy eater. <laughs> and he's dead. <sighs> I hated that. Oh, uh, yeah. But no, I, uh, Tim Carrey's. T- Tim Carrey. Uh, Tim, Tim Curry. Curry. Tim Curry's oh, v- version. Yes. No way. Um, but in the new one, once I see that fucker fold, unfold himself out of a refrigerator, dying of a heart attack. Yeah. Yeah, well, he's well, he's way scarier in that one. Yeah, time like, to float. The way, the way he uh, <gasps> freaking trans, yeah, trans, uh, transforms and shit. Yeah, yeah. But Tim Curry, you're right, dude. That yeah, he, that was fucking sweet. He's a good yeah. Carrie. Yeah, just be nice to her. Yeah, you win. But you're at that prom. Let's say you're at that yeah. prom. I'd be right beside you. You fucking asshole. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not yeah. pissing her off. We would. We would just walk like, get that one, Carrie. Get that one, yeah. Carrie. There goes, there goes that motherfucker. Yeah. That asshole stole my lunch money in the second grade. Yeah. Get his ass, get Carrie. Oh, yeah. Get him. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Just be nice. I yeah. Think you, I think you can survive that one. Now, if you're on the other side, you better hope she gets someone else before you. I mean, I don't know, man. I think I'd how play that. How far is her powers reach? Well, it, the whole gymnasium, it catches fire. Oh, yeah, that's right. They they burned. Oh, fuck, yeah. I don't know. I guess I tried jumping through a window. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah, I don't know. That'd yeah. be a tough one, but maybe. I think so. Like yeah. I said, I just yeah. walk up and start kissing ass immediately. Yep. Jigsaw. So, are we in a saw uh, scenario? Yeah. Now it just got a lot harder. Man, what's the scenario? <laughs> oh man, let's just say the let's say the first one. Let's say you're Adam. Okay. In the first one, you and I are Adam and the Doctor. Are we saw you you saw your foot off. Yeah, dude. If it was just if it was just Jigsaw, I think I'd be able to whoop his ass. Yeah, dressed. We as were clown. talking about fucking or uh, that the clown the the, the pig. Yeah. Well, fucking any of it, right? Even if it was a puppet, he came running in on the fucking tricycle. I'd just probably kick him over. Yeah, you know. But uh, man, just trying to survive some of those scenarios would be just be fucking intense. Yeah. Yeah, well, you're fucked on those ones, I think. Yeah, I think I'm fucked anyway. It's a Sunday. Yeah. Oh, yep. Easy. Yeah. Yep. All right. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you know this one. I don't know if you've seen it, but the Pale Man from Pan's Labyrinth. That's the yes. eyes dude. The yeah. eyes dude. The hands dude. Yeah, the hands on the, the eyes, eyes yeah. on the hands. Yeah. yeah. Oh, he wasn't in that movie a lot a long time. No, though, no, right? just it was only like that five scene. minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that dude's wicked too. He is wicked. Yeah. But all you have to do is avoid that food. Oh yeah, that's how he wakes up. Yeah, she takes like this big ass oh. grape. Like, dude, the food looks amazing. Don't eat fucking food. Yeah. Oh, oh man, that thing was fucking weird. Remember when he's walking down the hall and he's all like, "Yeah, <laughs> eating the fairies yeah. and shit." <laughs> oh god, dude, dude, that character could have been so much more. Yeah. Wow. Then, that, uh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I guess if you don't eat anything, you'd be all right. But yeah, I guess you gotta. What she had to do? Draw like a draw a door or something? No, yeah, something like that. She had to go or, get something. She had to get like an artifact, I think it was, and all they just warned her don't touch the food on the table. Yeah. And her being in the situation she's in, I mean she's pretty much yeah. starved. It's a yeah, shithole country. She grabbed the fucking middle grape. of the war. Yeah, she grabbed that big ass fruit and Yeah. Like I'd sit there, my my happy fat ass, I'd be like, All right, I'm gonna grab it and I'm gonna run. I, I'd probably make the door first. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah I'm going to grab yeah. a few things. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to line it up. I'm going to grab that. Yeah. The fucking lasagna. Yeah, I'm going to grab the lasagna. Uh, what got else? I'm going to get that meatballs. grapes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, strawberry shortcakes. Little yeah, Debbie's. That's <clears throat> definitely coming with me. Yeah. All right. All right, here we go. I guess it would depend, like, <laughs> what's on the table. Like, oh, yeah. No, fuck that steak, yeah. huh? Hmm. Why don't you, why don't you just... Oh, did he have? 
Oh no, his hands were the eyes. Yeah. That's yeah. Right. Like, Dude, just take his eyes. But no, that's right. Their eyes are in the hands. Yeah. Never mind. Ugh. That's not gonna work. <laughs> I think I think if I were to see him, I would freeze in fear. Like I'd be like, "Duh, fuck is that?" Yeah. Did they even? I can't remember. Did they warn her that that? Yeah. He was down. Okay, he was. Okay. Oh no! I mean, she didn't see him for a second. Yeah. And then the fairy started fucking with her, and she's like, ah, "Stop!" Yeah. And then here's that. <laughs> Here he comes, like I, was, yeah. I, yeah. Oh fuck that! I think yeah. I'd get away because he'd slip in the pile of the shit that I left from when I saw <laughs> him. <laughs> yeah. Oh god. <laughs> All right, Brandon. I want you to think about this. You're in our old school cafeteria. There's only one exit, one entrance, one exit, and what's between you and that? Are two Jurassic Park Velociraptors in between the accent? And the yeah, the accent. Oh shit! Oh, well, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you're not outrunning them, dude. Those fuckers. Are you don't fast. think you can sneak around like the kids? Like, are oh, you actually in the cafeteria? I thought you were talking about where just the tables are and shit. Oh no, <laughs> like, no, yeah, the ca- you know the tables, like you know you, okay, you can go in okay. between shit and man, I don't know. Those things run fast, too. Yeah. Fuck. I don't think I'll be able to do that. I don't think so, either. No, there's no I, way. I'd end up, like, Plus, even if you get out, over. it's like they can smell you and stuff, so what, they're going to track you down, right? Yeah. You're and done. they can open the doors, the little bitches. Oh, yeah. Remember the claws? Yeah. Remember how scary that was when they, they're sitting there? When he there? opened it, and he's like, oh, shit. You yeah, he's face-to-face, and all of a sudden the door started moving, and he's like, oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> That'd, that'd be that'd be a shitty situation. Nah, I don't think so. Nah, I'm toast. Yeah. The uh, It Follows monster. Oh, man, dude. Well, yeah. Actually, you should be able to survive it, because all you got to do is bang someone, right? Yeah. Yeah, so you just hook up with someone, then you're... You're saved. Oh. Oh. Right. Oh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, unless you can't bang someone, then you're, I guess you're done, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's gonna, you're gonna get killed. You so. think there's another way to trap it though? Like, is there a way to? Because it walks. It just walks. Yeah. Is it? Is there a possibility to trap it? And like does it like man like if it's trapped does it man can it manifest somewhere like if i trap that thing in a jail cell i would assume so can it manifest outside yeah. of it and just continue to walk i would assume it couldn't ain't they doing a second one i, mean, I don't they know they left it open spoiler warning fuck <laughs> yeah but uh i think th- i think they w- would but um yeah i don't know i guess i never really thought about that i would think it would just like uh there's a a person right there. I'm gonna jump in that person's body now. And oh, dude! I, guess, I don't know. That movie freaked me out. Just the fact, yeah, like really people walking. Yeah. Like, that's all it is, and it takes different forms. Well, that last like, scene when they're just walking down the sidewalk, and you see that person walking behind them. Yeah. Like, Fuck. Yeah. And then how do you put dude. like? All you have to do is ask each other, "Do you see that?" You know, because yeah. them two were the end chain, end of the chain. Uh-huh. It was like, no, I would not yeah. be okay. Oh, my God, the tall man? Fucking hell, dude, that scene was ridiculous. Yeah. Dude. Yep, not ideal. <laughs> yeah. What do you think was the worst one to be on? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. The worst form? I think the old lady would have ruined me. The old lady was fucking fucked up. The, that with kid the hospital too. gown? Yeah, that kid who came through the uh, that shed or whatever. Yeah. That fucking freaked me out. I don't <laughs> know, that tall man was really eerie. Yeah. The old lady was too. I, I mean, just got done telling uh, my wife about that. I was like, the old ladies and fucking little kids in horror movies? Man, they get me so good. Ooh, yeah. I, I don't know if I told this story on the show before but old people it was are you afraid of the dark and it was the girl that kept visiting that old lady 
at the end of the hall in the apartment complex. And she's like, I'd, I'd really like you to visit me this, this day. This day is very special. And the girl's like, okay, well, she's at that age where she's making friends. Oh so my she, God, I've so seen she this ditches one. her. And she yeah. comes back, and the old lady's like, like freaking out and haunting yeah. her. And she's like, that was the day that I died. Ever since then, old people scare the fuck out of me. Like, yeah. That's not even old guys, though. It's old it, ladies. Old ladies, yes. And, dude, there, and yeah. then there was one time. Dude, there was one time I was working at a place. It was a temp service way back when. And I hurt my shoulder. So like, okay, you can come work at the temp service and do clerical work and blah, blah, blah. I said, okay. They set me up in this office. My back is to the door. I'm putting together all these pamphlets and stuff. And like all of a sudden I'm like, someone's in here with me. Like I was like, someone's here. And I turned around and dude, this lady, dude, she looked to be like 110. I was just standing there at the, at like 10 feet inside the entrance. Didn't knock. And was just staring at me, and I was just like, Hi. oh, no, oh. she didn't say anything. I was like, can I help oh, you? And she's like, just seeing how you're doing. And I was like, good. Like, dude, cold sweat immediately. Dude. She scared the shit out of me. <laughs> oh, no. I was like, why no. did you come this far it, in the room and no, not, like, it, say anything? Like, I didn't have headphones on or anything. I was just working. Dude, what if she just, just fucking screamed? I was screamed. shit. I was <laughs> done. Just, I'd have been done, dead, the shit that right you there. Used to fucking do. We'd be sitting there driving, and you'd just yeah. like, ah! yeah, <laughs> Get the fuck out of me. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why I would do that to you, dude. I still remember your face, like looking at me, oh like, what the god, fuck, dude? Yeah, dude, I have bad visions about that shit happening, like when I'm laying in bed at night. Uh -huh. and I just hear it, in, like downstairs, just. Rah! Like, oh. I'm done. <laughs> yeah. What if you did hear that scream and then do, 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 like running up the I, stairs? I don't know, dude. You don't know how many times that that exact scenario has played through my head. Oh, hundreds, dude. <laughs> it's like I can't, I can't reach anything. <laughs> yeah. What, what's coming oh, upstairs? I don't fuck know. Fuck that. Yeah. Oof. Yeah. No. All right. That's like that, Mister Ball. You ever hear that, Mister Ball and sleep paralysis demon? I've heard of sleep paralysis demons, but not, I, I have I've I have a story. hard time listening to that episode because it scares the shit out of me. Oh shit, that's one I haven't heard yet. Oof, I'll send it to you. I've heard a lot of them. <laughs> you can watch it whenever you want, but it scares the shit out of me. All right, all right, the mummy, um, emo tap. Oh, oh, not the Tom Cruise mummy. Nah. Damn, she was hot too. Yeah. What would you try to bang your way out of that situation? I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh so oh yeah, dude, that would be a tough one too, man. You don't stop, huh? No, that was a like, damn. That put, I think that movie was like, hey, put some respect on my name for the mummy. Yeah. Wow, oh, shit. Um, wasn't there? Wasn't there a god or something that could stop him? Or Cats. kill him? Cats? I forgot I how they killed him. Like I can't that. remember. There was some, I thought there was a god. I might be thinking of Scorpion King, though. I don't remember. I know those movies mixed in together. Uh, yeah, I don't know. But probably not. Yeah, I think I'd, I would only be able to buy some time like the brother did when uh, the... the they were running at him, like the big group was running at him, and he's like, oh, yeah. emo tap. And he started acting like them. Yeah. And they all calmed down and started walking, yeah, emo tap. Like, all right, I can buy some emo time tap. right there. Yeah. yeah. Just releasing all the scarabs, the fucking beetles all over the place? No, no. Yeah. Dude. You know how scared I was of those things? Yeah. Like, how old was I when that movie came out? Like 11, 12? No Dude. Way. Yeah, what? those scarabs really? were not Really? Was that time cool. frame? Was it 99? 98, was it really? 99? Oh, damn, dude. I thought it was later than that. Well, let's see. I thought it came out when we were in, like, high school or something. 1999. Oh, no, no, you guys right. can say you might be right, actually. Wow. Whoa. No! You mustn't read from the book! That part was like, whoa. Yeah, nah, I don't think so. Yeah, all right. Now, I got the last one here. Um, I think this one's pretty easy. Pumpkinhead. 
goes without saying. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's fucking some ridiculous ass fucking monster chasing you. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'd be done. Yeah, dude, I remember when I was a little kid watching that for the first time, I was like, how do you suppose, like, that thing is fucking ridiculous looking. It yeah. It's so scary looking. Yeah. I mean, you can kill it with a gun. That's what they do in it, right? The, the, the chick I at the end. I can't remember. I thought the chick killed him with a gun. Oh, maybe not. But, yeah, probably not. Oof. Yeah, yeah. I'd be done. <laughs> So so we're we're pretty uh we're pretty low maybe like a twenty percent on all these yeah we we'd survive <laughs> yeah I think yeah I think death is a pretty certain thing yeah I yeah, guess I yeah. should stop yelling at the TV like come on you yeah run bitch <laughs> yeah <laughs> run yeah yeah which according to I think the the black community would survive these about ninety five percent yeah nope yeah <laughs> running yeah run. <laughs> I watched this uh, um, YouTuber for the longest time, um, and he's black, and he, he used to say that, and he played horror games, you know, and he'd be like, in a scenario like this, you see my skin? I'm out. Yeah. You know, <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> I go, I'm yeah. with you, dude. I ain't going to go, like, yeah. they want you to go forward? No, I'm going backwards. Screw this, dude. dude. <laughs> scary movie had it right, like, reported live on black TV, white folks are dead, we're getting the fuck up out of here. Come on, bitch, yeah. go shit up, let's go. They're gone. Uh, that was awesome. Yeah, yeah fuck yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. No. oh God. All right. So uh, to wrap this up, Brandon, do you have any hidden gems that like people Dude. have to watch during the Halloween season? Dude, I was trying to think about some of these. I ended up asking my boss about some like hidden gems and stuff. Um I couldn't really think of any right right off the top of my head. He gave me a good idea, a good one, because I, I watched it uh, when it came out. But have you seen Hellfest? I have not, no. Okay. That was pretty, that was all right. Like, yeah. I think that's an underrated movie, a uh, horror movie. And uh, I thought that one was okay. You know, I had some good jump scares here and there. But um, I think the whole, um, um, how everything plays out and stuff, I think I think they did a good job with it. So, okay. I mean, Watch Hellfest. That's a, that's a pretty good yeah. one. Mine, I got a few if you don't mind. Yeah. One one thing that I, I, I always try to show, this is one of my favorites from way back in the day, uh, Silver Bullet. Stephen King's Silver Bullet. I think that's an awesome werewolf movie. Mm. That one needs to be checked out. I'm always going to say this every single year because not a lot of people have seen it. Monster Squad needs oh, yeah. to be seen. Yeah, yeah. Um, Excellent movie, especially with the kids. Yeah. And then, dude, I watched this just recently, Ready or Not. Mm. That was a great movie. I got that one mixed up with Your Next because I was looking for Your Next. And I was like 10 minutes in. I was like, wait a minute. This isn't the movie I'm thinking of. But I was like, oh, I'll continue to watch it. Ended up being awesome. Ready or Not, dude. I would really check that one out. Okay. It, it reminded me of like an updated, like the feeling of it. It was a like it was comedic, but not. Okay. I can't explain it. It's like a black comedy. Okay. And then, um, dude, Nicolas Cage and Mandy. That yeah, see, movie I, I I have not seen so that. So fucked but up. I, I have seen the the fo- like photos and everything. So I have not seen anything about it though. I remember so. seeing. There's a scene where Nicolas Cage. It was on a reel where he was just covered in blood, and he has this crazy manic look on his face, and he's driving in this car, and I was like, dude, what movie is that? And I looked for it forever, and I was like, ah, I'm going to take a peek at this one. Maybe it's this movie. And I watched it, and it was so messed up. No way. Yes, that was a crazy movie. Crazy. Dude, Nicolas Cage has is those random fucking movies that are just like, whoa, like, where yeah. the hell did this come from? And then uh, Pearl. My what? my boss said something about Pearl too, so that is I didn't realize that is in a um, trilogy. What's the trilogy with? Uh, was it Maxine? Maxine and X. Yeah, and X. Yeah. So I have not seen X. I haven't seen any of them, but I I know of Maxine. Yeah. So. Yeah. See, I watched X first, not knowing what it was like it, it was a scene it was like sus- most suspenseful scenes and this girl is in a river and an alligator or a crocodile whatever it's just 
swimming slowly towards her. And she just has no knowledge of it. No and way. I was like, whoa, I'm going to watch this movie. And um, I was watching it, not knowing. I had no idea what it was going to be about. And what it was, it was like a group of people filming adult movies back in the 70s. They wanted to film an adult movie on this farm. And, man, is it, it took a turn where I was like, dude, what is this? And uh, I watched it and enjoyed the shit out of it. Like, really enjoyed oh, it. Oh, shit. Okay. And I'll then not knowing, I had no idea. I told my brother I watched it. He goes, yeah, have you seen Pearl? I was like, no, I wanted to. He's like, that's the sequel to Pearl. I was like, get the fuck out of here. And then I watched Pearl, and Pearl's way better. Like, Pearl is a crazy good movie. There's a scene where she's having dinner with her mom and dad, and that scene is so intense. It was awesome. I would highly suggest that one. No way. Okay. Yeah, Pearl is very, very underrated, I think. Really underrated. Noted. Yeah. I'm definitely going to give him a uh, look see. Yeah. yeah. Sure. X is really good, but Pearl, I thought, was great. And I haven't yet to see Maxine. I haven't seen that one yet. So. Cool. Yeah. Cool. Lots more movies to come, though. Yeah. Yep. We're going to talk about this all October. So, what do you think? Yeah. You want to revisit David Gordon Green's Halloween fran- uh, yeah. trilogy yeah. next episode? Yeah. Yeah, well, for sure. That'd be that'd be all right. Yeah, we just talk about what he did right, what he did wrong, what we wished he would have done. Maybe, okay. maybe talk about what we would do with the franchise. Maybe not. We kind of did that a little bit. Already. Yeah, we did not a little bit. The yeah, franchise, but just yeah, I guess we did. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we'll figure it out. All right, we'll figure it out. All right, you ready we'll, to wrap this one up? Absolutely. All right, we're on Bye. all. No, yeah. <laughs> We're on, damn. We're on all uh, podcast platforms, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and X. You know I always say those in a different order no matter what. Yeah, I know you do. I, mean, I, I got to get it to where like yeah. I just roll that just, off like, just the tongue better. Just write a better. sticky note and put it on your screen. Just yeah. Like, uh, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram. <laughs> yeah, we're 45 episodes in, and I'm still like, ah, what the fuck are we on real quick, so <laughs> – but yeah, hope you guys uh, enjoyed the episode. Uh, check out our sponsor, the uh, Haunted yeah. Banana Peeler. God damn. Oh, my Lord. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, till next time, my friends. See you later. Yeah.